Hey guys, welcome to another episode on MSK Coding. In this episode, I'll be showing you a program I made. This program calculates the electron configuration of any atomic number you enter in. This program is basically an add-on to the third video I ever made on the channel, which calculates the name of the element atomic number that you put in based on the well atomic number what do these videos about the periodic table so let's get into it so lm is input give the atomic number of the element you want to find the electron configuration of then lm is int of lm which basically turns lm into an integer then we create a new empty string named electconfig we then create a list named prefix, which has 1s, 2s, 2p, all the way to 5f, 6d, 7p. Then we define a function, maxoc, with the argument s to define a global variable, maxoq. Then if s of 1 is s, maxoq is 2, lf s of 1 is p, max oq is 6, all the way down to lfs of 1 is f, max oq is 14. Then we start a for loop. For x in range, len of prefix, which basically grows through everything in this list, we run this set of commands. Max oq of prefix of x, which is basically running the function. Then if lm is 0, break. That prevents any bugs um, about the number zero entering. Elif lm is greater than or equal to max oq. Alec config is equal to alec config plus prefix x plus string plus max oq plus well a space. Then lm is lm plus max oq. Then elif lm is less than max oq elec config is elec config plus prefix x plus string of lm break print lm print elec config so let's run the program as you see i had dozens of test runs on this but let's go through a non buggy state 20 that is calcium these are for debug purposes but here's the electron configuration 1s2, 2s2, 2p6, 3s2, 3p6, 4s2. Also, the way that I remembered that 20 was calcium was first of all because of my knowledge of the periodic table, but also because of the atomic number to element program that I made. If I run this program, give a number between 1 and 118, 20, then the element with that atomic number is calcium, and over here I literally just have debug. So yeah. That's a um, program that I made in one of the early days of MSK coding. And, well, it's a good one whenever I need some help. Then if we put 117, which over here is tennessine, as you can see by this right here. Then it goes through all of LMs, all of the LMs. Then 1s2, 2s2, 2p6, 3s2, 3p6, 4s2, 3d10, 4p6, 5s2, 4d10, 5p6, 6s2, 4f14, 5d10, 6p6, 7s2, 5f14, 6d10, 7p5. It's pretty long. So, well, I guess that's all for today. But one more thing. I am so close to 100 subscribers. And almost every video I get about to maybe two to three subscribers, depending on the video. So in some time, we'll be able to get to 100. Well, I'll see you next time. Have a great day. Bye.